Princess Charlotte has been tipped to receive the Edinburgh dukedom when she is older. The position had been promised to Prince Edward yet King Charles III has not honoured his younger brother yet. The dukedom was previously Prince Philip and Queen Elizabeth II's but following their deaths reverted to the crown in September. So who do you think should have the title? Vote in our poll. Royal expert Christine Ross said that the daughter of the Prince and Princess of Wales could make history by becoming the first Princess of the Blood to hold a ducal title in her own right. The co-host of the Royally Us podcast said during an episode last month, it would be great. It would be really historic as it would be the first time that this title, Charlotte would hold the Duchess of Edinburgh title, in her own right. So it's not related to her husband, and it has a little bit to do with the new guidelines for primogeniture which mean Louis cannot unseat Charlotte's place in the line to the throne. The king could bestow the Duchess of Edinburgh to his eldest granddaughter upon her majority or when she marries. Charlotte became the first princess to maintain her place in the law of accession and is likely to take on another title when her father Prince William ascends the throne. Ems Ross said, when William is king, Princess Charlotte will be the Princess Royal. So she will already have a special title in her own right. The Princess Royal title, held by Princess Anne since 1987 is customarily reserved for the eldest daughter of the sovereign and lasts the natural lifetime of the holder meaning she will not automatically inherit it if her aunt is still alive. The Edinburgh dukedom had been expected to be passed to Prince Edward and his wife Sophie, Countess of Wessex, once Charles ascended the throne. The couple were gifted the dukedom on their wedding day on June 19, 1999. At the time Buckingham Palace said in a statement, the Queen, the Duke of Edinburgh and the Prince of Wales have also agreed that the Prince Edward should be given the Dukedom of Edinburgh in due course, when the present title held now by Prince Philip eventually reverts to the crown. Royal commentator Richard Eden suggested that the change of plans would support the King's vision for the future of the royal family and help to streamline the monarchy. He told Palace Confidential, Charles has decided he's not going to give it to him, he's not going to really use it himself. That title stays with the crown but he doesn't want to give it to him. One of the reasons is that it's a hereditary title, if he gives it to Edward, it then establishes a new household. You've got the Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh their son James would inherit that title. He added, The view that I was told from the king is that Edward always accepted that slim-down monarchy, that's why his children didn't become prince and princess. They had some title, lady and viscount, but not that prince title and he accepted that. And this is part of that slimming down. Speaking to the BBC last year, Edward noted that the title was not definite, acknowledging that his eldest brother would have the final decision. He said, it was fine in theory, ages ago when it was sort of a pipe dream of my father's. And of course, it will depend on whether or not the Prince of Wales, when he becomes king, whether he'll do that, so we'll wait and see. So what do you think? Who should the king give the Edinburgh title to?